In this video, we are going to discuss the management and understanding of Bethesda system of classification in case of PEPS report. So, these days PEPS PEPS report that means cytology report done by cytologists or pathologist is fixed. It's only seven report you can generate. The report number one is unsatisfactory pap smear so, so what we do we repeat the pap smear within two months report number two it suggests of infection that is HPV bacterial vaginosis HSV trichomonas candida this kind of infection can be diagnosed so what we do is antibiotics and antivirals now comes to the report number three that is ASCUS that means ASC means atypical squamous cells of unknown significance so we do have present ASC but we don't know the significance of that ASC that ASC does not look like a confirmed atypical cells or carcinomatic cells so if the patient is of less than 25 years then we should repeat PEPS and if PEPS is positive we should go for colposcopy if it is more than 25 years then we should also add the HPV testing also if it's come positive anything of these two comes to positive we should go for colposcopic examination then the report number four that is L cell what is L cells low grade squamous intra epithelial lesion so now we got confirmed atypical cells okay and then we should directly go for colposcopy colposcopic examination and biopsy report number five that is ASCH that means a typical squamous cell that are confirmed L cell but we cannot just exclude H cell so CIN1 is there but we don't know that that can be CIN2 or 3 also so what we do directly do a corposcopy and do the examination okay there is a there is a another uh, report number six that is H cell in H cell we right now know that we have a confirmed H cell that is high grade squamous cell epithelium and now we have no option of going colposcopy and biopsy report number seven it suggests that atypical granular cells so we got the glands of the endomet glands of the endocervical tissue having atypical cells then we should directly go for excision of those endo uh, endocervix and we should also get a endometrial biopsy for that also so then we should go for excision method of lip thank you so this was all about the Bethesda system of pap smear thank you